This is the Triton T80Z Fast Fit Thermostatic. In this tutorial we're going to look at how to change a pressure relief device that has operated. I'll just show you where to look to make sure the pressure relief as you can see down at the bottom there, water is coming out along the actual wall. OK, so we'll stop the shower. We'll isolate the water. Then we'll take a look. I've already removed the screws for this purpose of this demonstration. Screws are normally top, two in the top and one at the bottom. OK, when you take the cover off, just behind the cover, located are two neons, one at the bottom and one at the top, which is the brown wire. So you can't get them mixed up because the brown one is too short. OK, I'll just put that down. Then facing you is a clear plastic tube and on the end of that clear plastic tube going into the side of the heating element is the pressure relief device. To change this you'll need a number one posi drive. You will need to remove the tube and you can just move it to one side, it should stay there, and then undo the screws and release the pressure relief device. There's one screw. And there's the other screw. Okay, then take the pressure relief device out. And it should come out and there's two parts. One is the holder, just there and the other part being a diaphragm. And just to prove this diaphragm has a hole in it, as you've seen the water coming out, there's the hole in the diaphragm, okay? What we need to do is we need to replace that, um, but before I show you how to replace it, you may actually see some of these older type pressure relief devices. Um, the new type are these black ones with the diaphragm, and they are fully compatible with the old ones, so don't have to worry about that. So all we're going to do is offer it back up with the new diaphragm on it and then replace the screws. Shouldn't take long to do. So put the next one in. You don't have to over tighten these once they stop turning, that's enough. And then replace the tube, making sure that the tube is pushed in also at the bottom. Once that's happened, we then can offer up the cover. In order to offer up the cover, you would need to replace the neon with the brown wires and then come across and also replace the one with the yellow and the gray wire. Okay. Then we would just offer the cover up So, once that's done, you would replace the screws, but I'm only just going to rest one in just to keep the cover on while we finish the demonstration. Okay, what I'll do now is wipe down the wall so you can see that there's no more water coming out. We'll put power on. So now I'll just demonstrate that there's no more water coming out. I'll turn the shower on. There's no water coming out flowing where it was before and the water now is coming nicely out of the shower head. So we'll stop that. And that concludes the tutorial on the Triton THZ Fast Fit Thermostatic changing the pressure relief device. If you'd like to know anything else about the Triton THZ Fast Fit Thermostatic or any other shower in the Triton range, please go along to the Triton website or to the Triton YouTube channel.